Hi everyone, this is Geeta and this is the first time I'm talking to you directly since I started my channel. I've been meaning to do this since long but I always thought I'll have to like glam up and do my hair and makeup and then come in front of you. But today I thought, what the heck, let me just be and talk to you. So here I am. Today I want to share with you about this subject uh, which is what I am and that is a single woman. Most of my life I've been a single woman. As a kid, I was the only child and then as I grew, I have of course got married, I have had a kid and everything but things didn't work out. So it's almost over three decades now that I'm enjoying the single status and I feel uh, when people ask me questions about life as a single woman, I have not seen it any other way, I mean since a long long time. So for me, this is my normal and I think people around me don't think it is normal. But let me tell you, being single from so long and uh, being uh, in a particular lifestyle uh, of staying alone, living alone, doing things by yourself, traveling alone and you know taking all your decisions alone, how it has shaped me and how it has helped me. So let's start with the first thing. Even as a child, of course I had a lot of friends, I had lots of relatives and extended families and everybody, but I learned to become very self-reliant. So since a very young age and even till today, I don't really depend much on people. Uh, the second thing it taught me was to take important decisions quickly and in such a way the, the whole rational uh, rationalization of that decision and the way it is uh, converted into a complete you know a sort of uh, the decision is complete and uh, an action is taken that whole process is very quick is that's how I do it uh, the third thing was that I never felt alone even though I was single, I've never felt alone. And that is because I've always had this childlike curiosity and I still have it. But I want to learn things, I want to do things, I want to experiment, I want to try. I want to just keep uh, understanding what is happening everywhere around me and try, and try to understand, grasp it as much as I can and then sort of leave it at that. I don't have to really implement each and everything that I learn but at least I can understand, at least I can be a part of a conversation if something new is happening or something is happening which was not there when I was young. So that is what I've always been doing and that has helped me never to feel alone. So like I studied acting at the age of 58 and this was a passion which was in me since I was a kid. In fact, even during my school and college days, I wanted to act, which I never got to do. And now I'm doing it. So you can do. And uh, I think these little things which made a shape to me, you know, to become a very strong, self-reliant, uh, you know, quick decision making person um, has helped me so much in my business. When I started work, it was, yeah, with some partner. But then I realized that when I took things in my hand and started taking decisions the way I thought right, it, kept, it just became such a game changer. And it became something which took me forward by leaps and bounds. So now to such an extent that in my city, in my environment, I have become like, you know, an example or an inspiration which I love. I love being an inspiration. I love being an example. I love being something whom people can follow or whom people can sort of relate to and whom people can talk to or share with and stuff like that. So these were the things which, you know, made my life as a single woman so much more interesting. I feel it has always been fun because you can just get up and go wherever you want. You can decide to travel wherever you want without considering the other person's 
you know budget or uh, their whims and fancies or whatever of course there are times when you travel with friends you travel with relatives i travel a lot with my daughter but uh, when you travel alone it is so so good you feel so liberated you feel so i think you you just feel so one with everything which is around you because it teaches you how to adapt to a new environment in a very different way which nothing else teaches you so yeah life as a single woman is quite an adventure and uh, if people uh, who have either become single because of you know loss of a partner or because uh, they have separated from their partner or divorced or uh, maybe you know uh, they just don't want to have a partner they should never think how will i do it or will i be able to do it or have these self doubts about it because however many people may be there in your life ultimately it is you and only you that is going to make your life better that is going to make your life worth living you will be the script writer of your life so don't get scared of being single and don't don't take decisions of getting with a partner for the wrong reasons maybe because you feel you will not be able to support yourself you will not be able to earn you will not be able to you know live without talking to somebody at night or some some weird reason which i've heard from so many people so just enjoy this adventure if you have the chance and if you are going to be doing it there is nothing wrong or right about any type of life it's just how you live it is just how you enjoy it it's just how you portray it and it's just how you imbibe all these little little things which are around you and make it you know worth living so let's keep sharing let's keep talking do subscribe to my channel and i'll see you soon again